Hey y'all, welcome back to the party. It's me, a girl, Brit Reacts. And you've bullied me. You've bullied me into finally reacting to Tony Hinchfield's part of Tom Brady's roast. Let's just get to it, all right? You know, a lot of you might not know this, but Dana is the millionaire founder of the UFC, and he's also a degenerate gambler. So that's <laughs> fucking awesome, Dana. Why wasn't he hey, on stage? Tom, what I miss? Great. Nice shoes, bitch. Did you win those in the divorce? Oh. <laughs> oh, I actually hate oh, those boots. I love it. With this that is suit. The stellar dais we have up here. Randy Moss. I was upset that Bill Belichick said he wouldn't give you a ring. You know what else doesn't have a ring? Bill Belichick's phone. <laughs> Everyone's up here talking about what a big winner Tom is. I don't but get let me it. tell you, Tom is afraid of the Giants which is why Kevin Hart is hosting tonight. <laughs> it's true. All night, he's been using the skill that Aaron Hernandez kicked out from under himself. Yeah. Oh, snap, Nikki Glass is like, all right. Here we are, you guys. Everyone's like, you're missing the best one. I like to troll y'all sometimes. Sometimes when everyone yells at me about one thing, I make you squirm. Uh, I just wanted to save the best for last because y'all kept talking about how good it was. I saw you in the comments. I saw it. And I wanted to make you wait. Here we are. Uh, I love what I've seen thus far of Tony Hinchfield, mainly and only from Kill Tony. Uh, he's got a wicked, quick-witted sense of humor. Uh, and I just think he's funny. Like, there's really nothing else. And clearly, y'all think he's funny, too. So let's keep going. That joke was ruthless, though. It's true. Ruthless. All night. Look at Kevin. He's, he's like... He's been using the stool that Aaron Hernandez kicked out from under himself. That? Yeah. It's Maybe true. too far. Kevin is so small that when his ancestors picked cotton, they called it deadlifting. Oh. So many he's got beautiful eyes. Up here. You know who doesn't pass? Kevin Hart on any movie he's offered. But we are here for Tom. Tom Brady is a patriot. He keeps he's like switching and going back to Kevin. He looks like a Confederate fag. Oh. Tom Brady. Why do you look like a gay Tom Brady? That's kind of true. He's Clearly like that beautiful. Takes after you. I hear she's out there draining balls right now. People love you, Tom. You have the same fan base as Kyle Rittenhouse. Oh! out there draining balls right now <laughs> people love you tom you have the same fan base as kyle rittenhouse oh gronk i'm happy you could take a that's break so bad santa letters to be here today poor gronk yeah who is it his roast it feels like it's I his roast. Were here when we were all out of chocolate milk backstage oh. By the way, Gronk, that's Kevin Hart sitting next to you. That's not your shadow. <laughs> Gronk, you look like the Nazi that kept burning himself on the ovens. You look like the final boss in George Floyd, the video game. Uh, the great Jeff Ross, ladies and gentlemen. I Jeff is so Jewish, he only watches football for the coin toss. <laughs> And of course, throwing long bombs at brown people. <laughs> Nikki Glazer, what a performance tonight, am I right? Absolutely killer set. I'm Nikki, scared for everybody. I'm your scared. Entire career. Oh, shit. Nikki has such a bad eating disorder, the industry keeps shoving her down our throat. You might recognize her from her podcast appearances, specials, and winning the Triple Crown at Churchill Downs. You might recognize Kevin as the jockey that rode her. He is literally flaming everyone, but at the speed of lightning. Like, it's like, can I catch my breath? Did he just call her a horse and Kevin her jockey? I'm done. You might recognize her from her podcast appearances, I'm specials, done. and winning the Triple Crown at Churchill Downs. 
You might recognize Kevin as the jockey that rode her. And that's Churchill Downs <laughs> the racetrack, not to be confused with what Jeff Ross looks like when he smokes a cigar. <laughs> Sam J, everybody. He's Kill. literally going through the whole lineup. An obese African American lesbian. So by having her, she's Jeff not Ross obese. Off a lot of boxes. <laughs> yeah. She is a black lesbo, which means she doesn't eat pussy. She all <laughs> hell gnaws on it. And the full circle moment happens right now because if you've been watching me react to all of these things, you know that I reacted to this first. This was the first snippet I found online. And then you all yelled at me and were like, you could just pull it up on Netflix. And I was like, I can't find any more clips. So very full circle moment to end where we started. And I didn't do that on purpose, I swear. I didn't even think about it, but here we are. It was a good joke. It was a yeah. good joke. She is a black lesbo, which means she doesn't eat pussy. She all hell gnaws on it. <laughs> Earthquake's on his feet. I'm killing. Who is Earthquake? That's you like the third time I've heard him. This. Her entire Wikipedia could fit into a fortune cookie. Aww. Andrew Schultz, I'm glad you took a break from watching YouTube videos on how to dap up black dudes correctly. <laughs> Schultz's mom is a professional ballroom dancer, which means she's a stripper that talks too much. Oh! <laughs> he is literally king. going down the like line. The Tiger King and the Liver King only ate Burger King and had a liver that looked like Martin Luther King got beat up by Rodney King. <laughs> I'm just so impressed. I'm so impressed at this rose. It's and how so good. About the appearance from the great Ron Burgundy, huh? A whale's vagina, which <laughs> reminds me, Kim Kardashian's here. She's had a lot of black men celebrate in her end zone. Oh my gosh. Word of advice, close your legs. You have more public beef than Kendrick and Drake. Thank you guys. Oh, she laughs. She's a good sport. Thank you, Netflix. She's a good sport. All right, I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. My baby's crying. I gotta go. That was perfect. Great way to end it. I hope you have the day you deserve. Bye.